This is the first ever partnership conference between the British Council and the Central Board of Secondary Education on the theme of furthering innovation and sustainability in schools. In today's school education conference, we have more than 300 education professionals who've come together along with 10 state boards and the leaders of these state boards as well as the education professionals who are here are discussing various ways in which they might implement the various suggestions of the national education policy as well as the national curriculum framework. The national education policy 2020 is there. In pursuance to that, we've got a national curriculum framework for school education. And I'm very happy that we are talking about innovation, we are talking about understanding climate change, we are trying to leverage technology to reach out to our students. And it's extremely important that our children understand what is changing the weather and how we are going to live and coexist with nature. And we're very happy that we and the British Council, we are talking about it and we are trying to find common solution. There has been a rapid spatial as well as numerical expansion of schooling facilities at all levels in India. And because of that, there has been a corresponding increase in the demand for teachers. So qualitatively, how are teachers meeting that demand? Because they actually shape our next generation. So we need to ensure that the best and the brightest actually join this system and also by ensuring that there is livelihood, respect, dignity and autonomy for all of those who are actually entering the system. Overall, the vision of the project is to ensure that within five years, all 28,000 CBSC schools in India will be supported to improve pedagogy and assessment practices. We will support schools also to effectively implement the environment and sustainability framework through resources and capacity building, which we will develop together. We work in three major focus areas, that is, transformation in the teaching training that is happening in the classroom, capacity building of teachers by providing resource materials and assessment reforms by bringing innovative practices in the assessment. And in the coming five years time, in addition to the teaching training and assessment, we will be also focusing on the environmental promotion aspects. So very strong collaboration between CBSE and British Council and this partnership helping all the CBSE affiliated schools across India and 25 foreign countries. We have just carried out a very large uh, scoping study of uh, what is happening in schools to understand whether the new approaches to competence-based uh, education are being implemented in schools. Exis has worked with the British Council of India very closely recently um, on a project called um, the CBSE CBE project. In that project we looked at curriculum assessment and pedagogy all together um, and we started by reviewing what was the current state um, of the curriculum, pedagogy and assessment um, from a CBE perspective and what were the gaps um, between that current state and where the system would like to be um, and then ECTIS made recommendations on how we could potentially bridge those gaps and um, we've continued to work together with British Council and CBSE to try to bridge them in the long run. We ran a project with CBSE and British Council looking at upskilling teachers in the development of assessment items. We provided teacher training to those to teachers so that they understood better how to write assessment items and then with those teachers we developed a bank of items that could be used by teachers across India to demonstrate those skills. The conference that the British Council has organized uh, with Climate Action as the core, it is bringing together educators uh, who are going to engage with young minds and uh, there is no better way than to introduce different researchers that are happening in this domain to educators who can then take it into their classrooms and engage those ideas with the students. To save energy and be resourceful. Find out what does sustainability mean and how can they make a change. Donate to recycle. Stop using single-use plastics. Responsible garbage disposal. Conserve natural resources. Being mindful towards scarce resources. In India, the National Curriculum Framework at 2023 mentions climate education no less than 54 times. It's really important that we support our young people so that they can adapt and mitigate the impacts of climate change in the future.